everyone doing? Hi, I'm Tammy and this is Faith Family Fashion. If this is your first time, welcome. I hope you are having an amazing day and thank you to everyone for coming back. If you have not already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell and uh, y'all leave me a comment down below. I love getting to chit chat with you guys. So I just wanted to do a quick little intro. I have a couple of, sorry, I keep adjusting my camera here. It's like not sitting where it's supposed to. Um, I just have a couple of little clips here I want to share with you. So I thought I would um, just do a little intro. So uh, it would maybe be a little more cohesive. So first you're going to see a clip, an unboxing. I had a company reach out to me that um, has kitchen products, y'all. And y'all know your girl loves to cook loves to be in the kitchen and has just moved and got rid of a bunch of stuff so there actually is quite a bit of stuff that uh, she actually does need so um, I'm gonna flip y'all around so y'all can see this beautiful little pond here okay y'all hold on uh, look at that look at all those lilies and those yellow flowers on there isn't that pretty look at that it's so pretty, right? I get to see this every morning, and it's uh, the train. The train's going by, so we'll go up here and see the train, and then we should, oh, it, it moved. All right, train's over. All right, just thought I'd check. Sorry, I think you're all adjusted. Okay, I have a couple of clips for you guys. Um, one is I had a company reach out to me, like I said, kitchen stuff. Got three little kitchen items to share with you guys. This is not a paid promotion. They're not paying me. They, um, I don't get any sort of kickback if you buy a product or anything. They just asked me to, if I would um, look at them, unbox them, use them, share with you guys. So it's real short. So it's just three little items and I will uh, link them below so that you can go They're They're sold on Amazon. So you can go and read up about them if it's something that you're looking for. So if um, you're not interested, you are welcome to speed on past that. And I have a grocery haul. Um, where did it go? I went to Winco, I believe. Yes, I went to Winco and I picked up a few groceries. So I have a small little weekly grocery haul. So Hey y'all, Tammy here, and welcome back to Faith Family Fashion. I hope everyone is having an amazing day. I have a different kind of video for you today. It's still kind of a haul video, but I have an unboxing video for you guys. Uh, I had a company reach out to me and uh, ask me to just try out some of their products. So I received them before I moved. I've left them all packed up but I did open the box here so I wouldn't be struggling to try to open it. And these are kitchen products. I love kitchen products and I actually need these. I got rid of so much stuff when I moved. Um, and this was just perfect. They reached out to me and they asked uh, me to just take a look at their products and to share them with you. So I will be linking these. I don't make any money off of this. Um, but they were very all very affordable and they are great so i'm going to show you what i got and then i'll give you a little more detail on them so the first thing that i'm really super excited about you know i have to put some glasses on and they're probably going to glare a little bit so forgive me because um, they have that uh, blue filter thing in them there we go okay see you can see it Anyway, so this is by, and I'm probably going to butcher the name, but it is Capersi Better Kitchen, and it is a cutting board. So look how big this is. I love a good cutting board. There is just something about it. <laughs> it looks so nice because not only is it very useful, this one actually does have the little uh, drip ring around the edge. Um, it says made of solid, oh, I'm going to butcher this name too, Acacia wood. It's sustainable and richly grained. It is stain resistant. Um, it says quick tip, Acacia wood cutting board provides a strong durable surface for all your food preparation, cutting, and task. Durable construction, easy withstands everyday use. Um, let's see, the board should be seal, seasoned with food grade mineral oil first, hand wash with warm soapy water, dry thoroughly, 
Uh, do not put the board in the dishwasher. Do not soak or submerge it in water. Um, occasionally rub with food safe mineral oil to keep the wood from drying out. So there you go. So this is huge. These are great for the charcuterie boards. We're getting into the holiday season again. Hopefully we're actually going to all get to celebrate together with some family. So, you know, using these for your display pieces, putting your cookies on here or your pumpkin and banana breads and you know this is just so fun to you know watch a movie at home fill this up with wonderful little munchies it's just a pretty 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 piece i'll put it up here so you guys can see it look at that isn't that nice so i will link all of these below and then we'll do another video um where i'm actually using these so i actually We'll use them, we'll do a little cooking, we'll cook dinner one night, and y'all, she was gonna like open this part, and oh, this is hard, hold on one moment. Okay, so, take this plastic off, because I'm gonna start using this stuff. So, here we go out of the plastic, so here we go, really nice, look at that, really nice. Nice and soft, it's not splintery, it doesn't feel cheap, it's got a nice weight to it. Really nice, right? So it's got this, if you do have a hook that you're gonna hang it on, but I just love displaying them. I definitely need this. So if you are looking for a good, durable, heavy charcuterie board, cutting board, um, this definitely might be something you wanna check out, okay? The other thing that I was really excited about that they asked me to try out is this rolling pin, guys. I did not have a rolling pin. And I know there's all kinds of them and they actually have a few different kinds. They have the one that's just the solid wood, but you know, I'm old school. I remember my mom and my grandmother having these with these little pins on the side. So I got one like that. And this is just says uh, rolling pin, high quality beech wood, no soaking or sun exposure. Um, and all of these are 100% satisfaction guaranteed. Um, let me see if I can get into this one. Okay, so here's just a closer look on that. Really nice. Who doesn't need a cutting board? And how, you know, for display purposes, you know, just having your rolling pins and your cutting board sitting up somewhere, super nice. Got that. And then the last thing that I got, which you kind of had a little sneak peek pick of, are these utensils. So this is a, a Capper C Better Kitchen. So it's the same brand. It is a wooden spoon set of four. So these are durable material, easy to clean, and they're food grade, y'all. Look at these. I don't know, do you love wooden spoons and wooden serving pieces? I just love them. So here we go, so y'all look at this. I, I'm loving this one. I can tell you I am loving this one, look at this. Nice, thick handle. They do have the holes in them, so if you have somewhere that you're hooking, you know, if you've got the pot rack up above or you've got some hooks that you are hanging your utensils on, look at that. So we've got that one. Then we have this square spoon, look at this. Really nice, solid wood. They feel good, they have a good feel to the hand. Look at that. Here is the slotted spoon, look at this one. Super nice, really, really nice. I mean, these are just nice, right? Whether it's you at home cooking for yourself or you're having some family over, you know, it's always the one thing I have to say that when I was younger, it was digging around or running to the Dollar Tree or somewhere to find some utensils, serving utensils for when, you know, I was having guests over and I was having, um, you know, dinner and stuff. It's always nice to invest in and have a really nice set of utensils. Whether you use these as serving utensils or cooking utensils, these are really nice. So let me tell you what it says here. It says Capper C wooden spoon set of four. Liven up your kitchen. Life in the kitchen is easier when you use the right tools for the task. The wooden spoon has a long handle to help you reach deep into deep pots while keeping your arms and hands safely away from the heat. Hand wash and thoroughly dry to prevent drying and cracking and to preserve the wood's natural finish, periodically apply a thick coat of food safe mineral oil. 
So it is Caperson, C-A-P-E-R-C-I.com. So that is the company. And again, there they are. So yeah, so I just thought I would share these with you. I've, I've had these a little while, um, and I just am finally getting to being able to, you know, have some time to get into some boxes, to get some stuff opened up. So, so there those are. So this is just my little mini haul, guys. I'm going to link everything below. I'm going to give you more information about these products. They are on. They are all on eBay. So not eBay. Oh my goodness. They are all on Amazon. Oh, strike that, y'all. They're all on Amazon, so you can go to Amazon. You can find these products, check them out. Um, like I said, I'm not. I'm not. I don't get any kind of extra money promotion, anything for. Um, if you guys decide to buy it, I don't have an Amazon store set up at the moment, but I will link them all down below. And if I do uh, set one up soon, then I will obviously um, link them in there as well. So that is it, guys. I hope you enjoy this. Okay, y'all, this is $22. Please forgive all the background noise. The dogs are walking around. So I picked up the Canada Dry, it was a dollar. This big giant one gallon of Hawaiian punch was 98 cents, guys. Uh, yeah, 98 cents. Is it the best thing? No. But if you've got kids and family or you're cooking out for Labor Day and you're going to have some people over 98 cents for that big giant jug. Look at this, y'all. Look, look at the big giant jug of Hawaiian punch for a dollar. The canned goods are 50 cents each, guys. I got the corn, the diced tomatoes, black beans, pinto beans, and green beans. I just got one of each. I'll go back and get some more and stock up. I don't have a ton of room right now. I've got to create room. I got a bottle of ranch. That was under a buck. Uh, I got next some breakfast food. So I got some of these uh, chocolate chip uh, Eggo waffles and the toaster strudel in the apple he loves those and then up here guys i got some barbecue sauce because i'm going to do some barbecue smoked sausage y'all i got thor a little dog toy it was on the clearance rack y'all don't tell him because he don't know yet okay and then over here this is kind of cluttered my coffee stuff is like here i got an onion a couple of cucumbers i got four limes and i got this big bag of uh, potatoes which was under two dollars so y'all that is everything for my grocery haul real quick little pop in at Winco like I said if you have one near you it is really worth just popping in there and seeing what their little daily specials are uh, because they don't advertise so much as far as sending out flyers and stuff uh, that's kind of how they keep the cost low so if you've not been in one uh, you do have to bag your own groceries so be prepared for that uh, but you don't have to pay for the bags like you do at Aldi's so y'all that's it I got to get dinner started before everybody's screaming for it so y'all remember to stop and thank God for today because it truly is a gift I'll see y'all next time